All right, well, there's no shortage of auto shows this time of year on Long Island, but we're pretty sure that you haven't seen a car quite like this one. Walter P. Chrysler's very own Chrysler. The discovery of the vintage car and its restoration, all part of Long Island's hidden past. We have a straight eight engine here. It's about 132 horsepower. You see this car coming down the road, it gets attention. This is the story of Walter P. Chrysler's Chrysler. The custom built limo from Long Island's Gold Coast belonged to automobile titan Walter P. Chrysler, who lived here in Kings Point. He used this car for four years as a commuter car. The sleek black limo built in 1937 to Chrysler's specifications is a one of a kind. This car was made to, to be seen. But for decades, Chrysler's Lux limo was lost. The ultimate barn find. The Long Island historian found the rusted out paint peeling jalopy tarped over and forgotten in a garage in Centerport. Right away he knew he stumbled across an amazing discovery. After it was, had basically disappeared for over 20 years. Kroplik bought the car and meticulously restored it to its yesteryear grandeur. The car was a gift from Walter Chrysler to his wife, Adela, and it's fitted with all the luxuries a woman would love. He wanted to show his love for his wife. That's why he built a special car. The limo also had advanced technology. The chauffeur would just pull up on the handle, Cars get locked, the window goes up. Magic. Magic. Might be the first power window ever built for a car. This car is like a piece of art. It's more than an automobile. Danielle Campbell, News 12, Long Island. Ah, oh, so beautiful. And then Robert Moses, his friend, of course, built the roads for the car, so it worked. It's all here on Long Island.